dear viewers uh, from my first lecture i have just changed that model little bit and i have uh, shift the trace here i mean i have just re-edited that model and i have done a mistake actually uh, here i will draw a stair but uh, here also i have provided slab so i'll just uh, remove that one by one but uh, we can use similar history from here you can select similar history and then you can select okay so if we select then if you see here uh, after selecting here this is uh, s1 i mean history one then we can simply press delete okay and uh, see here there it's a removed and now if i go sorry plan top apply okay so here if you see except uh, that trace slab wall slab have removed now to draw a stair uh, a stair i'll simply uh, i'll select from here all history all history and i'll select that history only and from here i'll just remove that okay, i'll work with that uh, that is true only and i'll just simply click here show selected object only so if i click here just see here yet selected object only are available and i'll also click a sit uh, remove that grid system set grid system visibility it will also remove so here now when it is done now we'll draw our stair here in that direction it's 15 okay and in that direction it's 7 feet and 15 feet so uh do it quickly i'll draw our stair for that i'll just don't draw then i'll click here draw joint object and from here when i'm here then i'll just give here the value 3.5 i'll give uh, for a residential building 3.5 feet that means 42 okay uh, and here i'll take it sorry again i have done a mistake control z i'll just make it on a string okay and from here that is 42 and here i'll just take the point also here i will take that point and here at middle i will also take a point and that will be x direction or y direction so i'll just close that and here i'll just take zero i mean 42 uh, positive then enter then you can click here okay then escape now if you take your mouse here just like that uh, move your uh, structure and you'll see here some pointer you are showing some point here okay so uh, after that again i'll just go here draw joint system then i'll take x 42 again then enter and from here i'll take another point i'll just escape when it's done when our all point is done now here is our another joint point okay uh, now we'll draw slab so for that i will select that option draw floor slab and from here i'll select six inch okay first of all i'll take that first part then i'll take that on then i'll take carefully that on and i'll take that on and take your mouse outside and enter okay so here see our on slab is okay now i'll just zoom out then i'll skip okay now when it's done now we have to draw some point here so uh, from that point to that point it's 10 feet so at 5 feet top we'll take our point so uh, the top direction is y di uh, x uh, z direction so here if we see it is z direction so we'll take two points here for that again i'll go draw draw joint object then from here i'll just for z i'll take five feet five feet means 16 then enter 
right here one point and here one point then you skip and after that move your structure and if you take mouse here just see here here is a point here is a point and uh, if you take take mouse here is another point so here is our two point okay now with respect to that two point we'll draw a portion here also okay and here we'll provide a here we'll provide a beam to support our that slab right for that i'll just come here draw i'll use that option draw beam to uh, carefully to draw beam with respect to point you have to select that one okay so from here uh, line drawing type estate line from here line drawing type will be estate line and from here it's beam okay now from here select the that joint point here is the joint point after that you just select you have to find out that joint point then click then enter so here is done actually right then i will press enter now i'll take point here for that again i'll go draw then draw joint object now i'll just uh, take minus x direction it's 42 sorry minus 42 enter then here is one point and here is one point and at middle we have to take a point also so i'll just close that and 3.5 mean 42 42 in y object then here if i take it's okay so here the middle point when it's done and also i have to take another point 50 42 minus 42 for opposite direction minus 42 then enter and from here just with respect to that point okay it's done now i'll just skip and if i move okay if i move it will be a little bit difficult to find out that point actually so i hope here is our one point here is our another point and here see here is one another point and here is another point this is our four point and at middle they have another point here is another point and here is this is the six point okay actually you have to find out that point like that okay so for our work see if i just move that you see here here is our six point now we'll draw a slab here also for that i'll just select that option okay and from here slab six inch and uh, please wait for some time so we have selected six inch but uh, we need to move that little bit to confirm our that point actually so that is our first point that is our second point and here we have to find out the third point and here uh, you have to move that is the fourth point and enter you see here is our another slab okay now here we have to draw another point also like say i, I mean in same way okay otherwise or uh, we can move that slab to top but i will use the same way to draw just come here draw similarly 42 enter one point two point then uh here is the one point and here is another point okay and uh, i'll just remove that and here i'll draw another point 42 for y then enter and here is our another point and similarly i'll draw another point here 42 for offset here is the another point then escape and if we little bit move our structure then see here is one two three here is the pointer available here okay actually 
when you are not seeing your point just simply move that and you will be able to see that okay so now simply again we'll click here that is six inch and that is our first point that is our second point that is our third point and that is our fourth point and simply enter and wait oh sorry what happened actually here control z control z control z control z uh, so again i'll come here with that point that is a point i mean slab we've selected slab So this is first point, this is second point, that is third point, and that is fourth point. Then remove it here, then enter. Okay, it's done. When it's done, now we have to draw another slab. Okay, so for that, uh, that is okay. From here, that is our first point is our second point that is our third point here is our fourth point and enter okay and here also first point second point ah uh, sorry <laughs> control Z skip just click on that point go back actually here it's not showing in that version it's making some problem to showing that point also so again I'll just come here so that is our first point second point that is third point and that is fourth point and enter okay and here that is our first point that is our second point that is third point this is point four enter so just see we have uh, draw our stair successfully here if we see uh, draw have drawers stern successfully right now we'll just replicate that so i'll just escape everything and i'll zoom out okay and from here i'll select that on that slab i'll select that slab that slab i'll select that slab here so i've selected on that four slab okay Uh, is it selected or not yes it is it is selected so we have selected that four slab not that slab after that we will go for replicate so we'll replicate for that is uh, first story second third and fourth okay so we'll go here edit then replicate then from here a story i'll go for top two uh, second third and fourth then just when you take your mouse you will see the view when it's okay then simply press apply and okay just see it's totally okay okay we have draw our ester successfully now we can right click and show sorry we can right click and uh, we can select that option show all objects so see here all objects are showing here okay 
if I just go into remote Let's see it's perfectly showing everything here and we can go in extrude mode here and if I move that little bit looking great so uh, it's done actually we have also draw our a stair in that lecture right so in our next lecture I'm just going to show you that how we'll apply load and how we'll go for analysis so thank you thank you very much still stay connected till next video and uh, I think uh, from that version our previous version is more better because that version are very really heavy and also uh, this point visibility is not so good. I mean, uh, I think so actually. So when you use, actually my PC is in low end PC. I mean, not so much high powerful PC. So if you work with that, maybe it will work with you very much. But it's not working for me perfectly. That's why I'm just telling that. Let's see. It's actually in extrude mode it's a change their good visibility system and it's looking great so that's it so in our next lecture I'm just going to show that how we apply load and how we we'll design that structure perfectly so thank you thank you very much stay connected till next video